Okay, I've backed um, Lord Alderval in this race. Um, it's a PS selection, um, maybe about 55. There's three uh, uh, almost joint favourites here, about three, um, three, the first three in the market. Um, I've already made it for about 13, 14 pounds profit, so um, uh, my liability, if I lose the uh, whole 16 pounds, so back to about 12, 12.5, is only about two pound fifty three in this race, but I'll get out with a stop loss as it is an outsider, and uh, see how it goes. See that um, I've got a stop loss there for um, a five pound twenty eight profit, which is around about uh, twenty twenty five percent. It uh, looks like it's going to lead, um, so it's been back down slightly. So we only need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, but seven or eight ticks to um, to get the profit. I'll put a stop loss in once it once the race um, starts for about maybe a five or something like that, nineteen twenty. It's just quite a long race, three miles. Will we ever start? This this event is now in play. I mean, I'll put the stop loss in there. So it's um, off the lead. I'm jump fairly skew with at that one. by a neck to Little Windmill, then two lengths or so to Secret Sting in third, then Instinctive on the inside, and Kenford Myth as they jump the next, and safely over. Little Windmill going up on the inside of Lord Aldervale as they head down the hill. Little Windmill in the cheek pieces on the inside, red sleeves worn by Trevor Whelan, Lord Aldervale, wider Andrew Glassenbury. They're followed by Secret Sting and Mark Goldstein on the outside of Instinctive in the blinkers for the first time and Kenford Myth is the back marker. Now on to the open ditch at the foot of the back straight. Little Windmill and Lord Aldervale. In the air pretty much together. Secret Sting over in third, Instinctive and Kenford Myth in these very early stages as they run round the railway bend. And Lord Aldervale reappearing after... Getting on for a year off the course. Last runner, in fact, was in a point to point. He's actually uh, over 700 so, days since he lost. We're out with the profit. Fairly easy. Um, £18.72. Um, the majority of that was made with uh, pre based training, but um, we did make a fiver out of it. Um, won't bother watching the race anymore, but um, that's it.